Baseball News Club with another baseball tragedy. Former professional major league knuckleball thrower Charles Hager was found dead from a self-inflicted gunshot wound on the south rim of the Grand Canyon on October 3rd. He was actually being sought in the shooting death of his ex-girlfriend, Daniel Breed, from October 2nd. She was the owner and manager of the Tipsy Coyote Bar and Grill in Scottsdale. Now, his body was found on October 3rd. The crime, in fact, happened on October 2nd. The roommate for Danielle heard gunshots in the apartment. He came out of his room and he saw Charles Hager coming out of her room with a gun in his hand. He aimed it at the roommate. The roommate then ran away, went to neighbor's house and called 911. The SWAT team showed up thinking that Hager was still in the house. They went in the house. He was gone. After that, police announced they wanted to speak to him. They considered him armed and dangerous and asked for the public's assistance to find him. The search was halted on October 3rd. Basically, they found his unoccupied vehicle in Flagstaff. He must have solicited a ride to the Grand Canyon, but somebody heard a gunshot at the Grand Canyon, and then his body was found thereafter. The mother of Danielle stated that the daughter was going to get a restraining order against Hager for cyberstalking. According to the reports, they dated for quite a while. However, they broke up a month before this incident, even with the efforts from Charles to get back together, and she refused to get back together with him. Hager played for the Red Sox, the Padres, and the Dodgers, and the Seattle Mariners before ending his career in 2010.